Hello everyone! Today, I'm going to show you how to make a GIF in Canva. Let's dive right in. First, choose the type of design you want to create. You can select from predefined sizes or create a custom size depending on where you plan to use the GIF. Each range in your Canva design will become a frame in your GIF. Next, start designing your first frame. You can add text, images, shapes, and other elements as needed. Make it look exactly how you want the first part of your GIF to appear. Click on Add page if your next frame is completely different from the first. In my case, I'll just have to change the text and background color, so I'm just going to duplicate it. Each new page will be a new frame in your GIF. Design each frame according to how you want your GIF to animate. For example, if you're creating a text animation, change the text and colors in each new frame. Canva allows you to animate individual elements or entire pages. Click on an element or select the whole page. Then, choose an animation style from the Animate menu at the top of the editor. Next, click on the small arrow at the bottom of the screen to show all pages. We're going to adjust the duration for each page. Click on Duration. The current duration is shown at the bottom left of each page, which is 5 seconds. To change the duration, hover over each page and drag the left or right side. Use the play button in the top right corner of the editor to preview how your GIF will look. This step helps you ensure that the animation flows smoothly from one frame to another. Once you're satisfied with your animation, click on the share button in the upper right corner of the screen. Then select download. In the download options, choose GIF as your file type. This option will compile all the pages into a single GIF. Click the download button to save your GIF to your device. And that's it! You've just created a GIF in Canva. If you found this video useful, please show your support with a like. Your feedback is invaluable to us, so feel free to share your thoughts and suggestions in the comments section below. We're eager to hear from you!